across the country are preparing their members for situations like that. News Center 25 Lashana McEwen finds out what the church here is doing to prepare their members. I spoke with a local church here in the crossroads to see how they are preparing their members in case of an active shooting. A couple of months ago, I think it was May, we did an active shooter, an active church shooter program where we had the Victoria Police Department come out and give some great instruction and we had several churches come out for that. Harold Thomas is the assistant minister at God's Church of Restoration. He's attended the church for approximately eight years, and he said he hopes these church shootings don't stop people from attending. I think every time something like this happens, we truly believe that it is a, an attack that Satan is trying to discourage people from going to church. We know that church attendance is down as it is just because the world is, is, is creeping in and people are just doing other things. Thomas wants to leave the families of the West Freeway Church who lost their loved ones a few words of encouragement as we enter the new year. We, we certainly lift them up in prayer. That is something we are going to be doing tomorrow when we have our uh, New Year's watch night service. We are, we are going to say a prayer, a special prayer for those two martyrs who definitely died in, in the service of Jesus Christ. In Victoria, I'm LaShonda McEwen for your hometown news.